This video we're going to talk about Tokyo Avengers Christmas Showdown Art Episode 3. Yeah. Sila pa sa nila ng Tokyo Avengers guys. This one. Anyway, keep on watching and subscribe to this channel. Wow, it's quite a... Uh, it's quite an eye-opening episode in its own right, but... Our analysis of this episode doesn't uh, doesn't stop there, guys. Right? First order of business: the thumbnail. This is the usual surprise look that we, we we would see in Takenichi every time uh, a twist in the storyline happens. It's nothing short of a classic. This occurred right after uh, Mitsuya told Hakai that he's going that he is rejecting. Akai's resignation from Toman. So, we're going to move to Takemichi later. Probably the most, surprise, the most surprising twist of this episode. Hence, the thumbnail. With that out of the way, let's get to the nitty gritty of this episode. Face! First, uh, third of the episode, at least, major tension facing kasi. Well, as usual, pinupog po si Takemichi dito by no less than the leader of the Black Dragon, si si uh, si Taiju. Do I have complaints? Bottom line. No guys, Phoenix told your Revenger spacing. It was slow when it needed to be. It was fast when it needed to be. And kapag nagkaroon ng biglang kampo sa story, appropriate yung uh, yung transition between facings. So, uh, first gear shift here was when well, basically to save Takenichi, Hakai is forced to resign from Toman. Kasi sinabi niya kay sinabi niya sa kapatid niya si Taiju, yeah, magkapatid sila, na, alright, to, to keep you from beating up uh, from beating up uh, one of my cap, one of Toman's captains, I'm quitting Toman. No brainer but you should there, folks, because it is it has sparked the chain of events of this episode. And uh the whole confirm na ni Takinichi ko na kung talagang yeah the the events that will lead to the future that he knows is now starting to unfold na right there and then. Second gear ship was when. Takemichi spilled the beans to, to Chief Uyo. No brain of a gear shift there, folks. Dahil, although na medyo in-express, kailangan mo bang i-detalye natin yun? Right? Kailangan mo bang i-detalye yun? Although na in-express ang, uh, uh, ang gear shift na to, you will totally get the idea. Right? That, well, Takemichi at this point realized that he needs to really open up to his kakapit in the past, which is Chief Uyu. So, will this strengthen their alliance? Absolutely. Final gear shift was when Mitsuya rejected Hakai's resignation. I've been telling you guys, from the very... From uh, from at least the first half of this review. This is the monkey wrench of the storyline. At least for this episode. Again, no brainer of a gear shift. Kasi, at this point, wala nang magawa si Takinichi. Mukha talaga matutuloy na pagpanis ni, ni Hakai sa Toman at yung kanyang paglipat sa Black Dragons. Then, Mitsuya drops a bomb. Hakai, I am not accepting your resignation. I won't allow it. So, hence, ayun, the surprise to Takemichi's face which led to our thumbnail. Was this a good setup for the next episode? Absolutely. Because that's what gear shifts do. So these three gear shifts that I saw, guys, Ite, pag pinanood nyo lang ang tatong gear shift na to, watch the whole episode. Right? And, kasi, you totally miss out on how Taiju beat uh beat the shit out of Takemichi here. Eh, alam na natin lahat na. And right now, Takemichi Hanagaki is 
anime is favorite. One sick bag and cry deep deep. You totally miss out on that on on that on, uh, on that uh, on that trademark of Takenichi. Okay? On that trademark by Takenichi. Trademark na ni Takenichi yun guys. Kaya watch the whole episode, right? To, to fully appreciate. Plot wise. Yeah. Tratado ang plot, guys. Why did I call it uh, an iron out plot? Basically, may mga flashback sequences dito. Especially during the second gear shift. Because Takemichi practically spilled all the beans to Chifuyu. Siyempre, kinikwento na rin ni Takemichi dito yung kanyang thoughts on on uh, on how he spilled the beans and why. So, kumbaga, hindi lang flashback sequence to, explainer sequence na rin. But, you can't deny the fact that it is a flashback sequence. It took 3 to 4 seconds. Kumbaga, from flashback ang buong season 1 in this, uh, in this sequence. In order to give the, uh, uh, to give the new, give new viewers an understanding of what went on during season one and it leading to the events of season two so far. Yeah, well ironed out. Okay? Lion Girls did a bit did a did a good job in uh in ironing this whole plot out. So based on plot Y'all can be for this episode folks. It was another riveting episode of Tokyo Revengers. Wow. Uh, from this moment on, I cannot wait for for the showdown between Tolan and the Black Dragons to uh, to to happen, right? Pero either way, it's inevitable, ne? So, Tokyo Avengers Christmas Showdown Art Episode Three. The second gearship was pretty dramatic. Two thumbs up! The second gearship was the um, was the clincher right there for me. Because uh, Takemichi was was in a pinch right there and then. Hindi niya talaga alam kung ano gagawin niya. So, he had to spill the beans to Chifuyu. Again, did it solidify their alliance? I'll put it at 80-20. But uh, it, it doesn't erase the fact that Chikyu, that Chikyu is an idiot. Si Takinichi no is wala sa dito. Alright. May plan A and plan B pa sila na nabaw. But, grabe. But, hey, yeah. Takinichi also provides the comic relief of this, uh, of this, uh, of this, uh, otherwise very serious anime. Yeah, he's still the main product of this anime. <laughs> Even though he gets beat up more times than you than you could ever count. So, what do we do now, guys? Especially the Tokyo Revengers fans, wait for the next episode. In the meantime, watch the other reviews on this uh, this playlist, okay? Sample.